sup virgo welcome back to my channel let's get started on your read should we pull an oracle first um good morning to you virgo i hope you're doing well today let's see here so you have truth be told coming out virgo damn what the fuck up so you got blessed in here and now so virgo i feel like you're highly blessed you're highly favored you're blessed and highly favored i feel like um something about accolades virgo i'm picking up on uh, here and now i feel like you could be doing something right now or i feel like you could be doing something now that has to do with like your longevity okay um the number 22 and 32 could be significant to you i feel like you're seeing eye to eye with someone or i feel like someone's seeing eye to eye with you this could even be a relationship matter for someone um i feel like there's conspiracy there are there could also be third party is what i'm picking up on uh so something about where you are virgo in life or i feel like this is your stance something about your stance here um someone could be a ballerina or i feel like someone could be uh is it ballet or something I think it's valet or, or ballet or someone could be a valet driver as well that's what i'm seeing here <laughs> um also virgo something about church i'm also seeing something about a womb this is a womb or i feel like this is uh a shell virgo so something about the hermit shell I'm going to post it. I think I'm going to use this as the thumbnail, um, Virgo. Something about the hermit shell. I also see love all around you, Virgo. Take it how it resonates. Something about love being all around you. I feel like someone wants you to feel like you're you're stricken, or someone wants you to be stricken, or someone wants you to not have what you have, or someone they don't want you to i even feel like virgo someone they don't even want you to do your day-to-day -day task like i feel like someone's so caught up in their own bullshit or i feel like you've shined a light to a certain degree they don't even want you to display what you're displaying or someone they don't even want you to tell the truth almost it's like you're talking too much virgo or something like that or the truth hurts that's what i pick up on so you have five of swords energy coming out here. So this is straight hate, Virgo. Um, I feel like you're dealing with haters, straight haters. Five of swords. This could be competition in a love life for someone here. I'm picking up. <laughs> I feel like um, something about your energy. Your energy is very, very strong. Uh, I get you're fighting or you are a warrior when it comes to something in particular i feel like you're a warrior virgo um when it comes to whatever this is you're dealing with like pat on your back type energy like something about refuge pat on your back i feel like um someone deserves to give you a pat on the back or i even feel like someone needs a hug i feel like someone fights constantly day and night day and night and it's kind of like exhausting is what i pick up on as high priest Let's see. Uh, so you have the Knight of Cups, Virgo. So for many of you, this is a love offer. I feel like this love offer is exhausting. This relationship that you're in, High Priestess energy here, is exhausting. Very, very exhausting. Or I feel like someone's exhausting all of their efforts or something about the exhaust. Someone's exhaust pipe or some type of system. Ace of Cups energy. Some type of system this could be or this could even be an actual exhaust pipe um this could also speak of fluids when it comes to a vehicle so someone may need to get their oil changed that's what i'm picking up on or i feel like this is a love relationship for many of you this is something new um i feel like genuine feeling in this relationship but it could also be exhausting or i feel like um decisions some type of decisions that you may have to make virgo as business owner queen of pentacles so whatever type of decisions you have to make here with the two of pentacles energy and the queen of pentacles i feel like it's like teeter-totter teeter-totter or um 
something about Saw, the movie Saw here, where I feel like you saw something, Virgo, or I don't know, take it how it resonates, or someone they saw you, or you saw someone else, Queen of Pentacles and the Two of Pentacles, so this could be a bitch I feel like you're dealing with, I feel like a bitch constantly watches you or stalks you secretly. I feel like someone secretly watches you. Also a white man for many of you. I don't know what the fuck this white man wants with you, but he watches you. He stalks you. Also, um, I feel like he likes to listen to you. Someone likes to listen to your surroundings or I even feel like someone's phone could be tapped. Okay. Um, now if you're not a business owner, say you're, you're doing something, uh, a Virgo that it's between me and you, right? Let's just say it's between me and you. I feel like someone's phone could be tapped. So be very aware of that or the devil card, most certainly. So restrictions, where I feel like you could be dealing with the Capricorn. This person can have Capricorn highly aspected when it comes to you. I feel like a need for you to move in a different direction when it comes to maybe um the things that you use to communicate with with the devil card so this could be devices this could be a numerous of things things that you use to exhaust exhaust your, your efforts or whatever you use to exalt yourself um let's see so you have the emperor and then you have the four of swords so i feel like sagittarius or aries energy okay and you have the two of cups uh whoever this person is I would say they hang around the majority of white people. No, no racism type shit, no disrespect, but they, let's say you're African-American, right? I feel this person, they like to only hang around American people or Caucasian people. Um, I feel this could be for image, Ten of Pentacles energy. I feel this could be for image or I even get they just like to surround themselves with Caucasian people for a specific purpose, possibly for connections, Ace of Cups energy, as far as the choices um, that they make when it comes to the Queen of Pentacles energy. So this is a bag. I also get someone could be bleaching their skin. Someone could be bleaching their skin or I feel like someone, they... They don't identify as African-American. They, behind the scenes, they, Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius, they don't identify as African American. Um, whoever this person is, they could be in the public eye. Uh, they don't really. <laughs> should I say, if you a nigga, you a nigga, they don't really fuck with niggas as far as fucking with niggas. They kind of just so associate with niggas for this this pinnacle um really strange message odd message so what i get is someone is a clown okay i get someone's like a clown a circus clown or something like that let's clarify it so you have the sun car and the devil so could be some harsh information or harsh news to come upon uh, virgo during this reading but this could be a queen of pentacles energy or I feel this could be someone you work with. Um, the sun card could be a Leo. Crazy ass Leo. Uh, there's a devil or I feel like there's a demon associated with this Leo person. Uh, this Leo queen of pentacles person could be cancer as well. I see a cancer being closed off to this person for a specific reason. Um, like I say, I feel like someone walks this dog. They walk this dog. Nine of Pentacles and you have the uh, Six of Cups. A significant connection, um, Virgo here. Nine of Pentacles, independence. Or I see you making a connection when it comes to your independence. So this could be a Virgo. You have the Hermit and the Eight of Pentacles. A conversation or I feel like... This needs to come out of this person's mouth, Virgo. Excuse me. I feel like this needs to come out of this person's mouth. Or I feel like this person... It's hard for them to articulate. Like, this energy is very, very toxic and it's nasty. Like, I don't know. I can't even articulate it myself. I can't even channel it. 
it's like something judgment judgment energy it's it's something else it's otherworldly it's what i pick up on six of pentacles energy and the queen of wands it's it's otherworldly clarify that spirit five of pentacles it's it's not of here it's poverty it's it's not in the church it's more so outside of the church page of cups justice it's it's not in the church it's outside of the church it's not of god okay is that it it's not of god the justice and the page of cups truth clarity divine comfort i feel like uh someone they concoct a lot of shit like they concoct a lot. This is a Libra. There's a small love offer when it comes to a Libra. Tower card. Someone's slow as fuck. A Libra made a, a slight gesture. Dumb dumb. Let's see this. Two of Swords energy. You see this? Look at her face. You see her face? Libra know exactly what's going on. <laughs> you see her face? Anyways. Oh. Hierophant in the reverse. Hierophant in the reverse. Look at this man. He pissed. You say whoever this person is, they like to wear shirts that are huge, humongous, or big, or baggy type of wear. They wear baggy shit. Something could be huge. Libra picking up on it. Hierophant in the reverse. Someone's not committed to God. Unfortunately. I feel this could be third party energy when it comes to a Virgo. Yeah, deception surrounding an investment is what I pick up on. I see someone only investing investing their time. Investing their time to deceive. Someone's slow. Someone views someone else to be slow as fuck. <laughs> Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius energy. Or I feel like someone could be viewing you to be slow, Virgo. Or you're viewing this Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius to be kind of slow. Yeah, revelation here, I feel. Big, big revelation for this person. What is the Queen of Wands? Six of Swords energy. So spiritual healing I'm seeing where I feel the Queen of Wands she needs some spiritual healing. Um, Seven of Cups energy and the Page of Cups. I feel like um, propaganda when it comes to multiplicity or something was going on. I feel like something was supposed to transpire or take place or someone was supposed to be doing something, right? But instead they were not. Yet again, uh, a dumbass motherfucker, Queen of Wands energy, Ten of Pentacles for a very, very long time. I feel like... Um, there's multiplicity surrounding this this unit okay whatever this foundation is it's a lot of shit that go on with this foundation seven of wands energy a lot of shit backfires or a lot of shit is going down a lot of shit is going on when it comes to this unit so for many of you this could be a foundation a job some type of job sector i'm seeing a lot of shit backfiring or shit is real slow could be a Pisces you're dealing with. I feel shit is real slow surrounding this foundation. I feel it's so motherfucking nasty. I'm just feeling it. It's high priest, Virgo. It's so motherfucking nasty. I feel like it's some shit behind the scenes. Like when you open that door, ooh, they say as soon as you hit the fucking door. My goodness. Clarify this. Clarify this. So you have the Three of Cups. Followed by the Queen of Cups. I feel like there's celebration. A lot of shit going on. Like all this party and party and party. And ain't no clean up. Ain't no clean up. But party after party after party. Motherfuckers coming together chit chatting. And ain't no cleaning up. Ain't no soap, water. Ain't nobody commit themselves. Not yet. No commitments. What's going on? 
What the fuck is the uh, Three of Cups and the uh, Queen of Swords? Get more information on this Cancer Pisces or Scorpio. Whoever this motherfucker or bitch is, they playing games when it comes to a unit. Clarify this. Restrictions need to be when it comes to this Capricorn, Cancer Pisces or Scorpio. Clarify this. So you got the Ten of Wands and the Lovers. Whatever the fuck is going on with this Queen of Wands, this Leo energy. I'm sorry. The motherfucker ain't gonna never go on one chill. So what you gonna do? Fight the whole world? This the third party when it come to you, Virgo? Your relationship? What you gonna do? You gonna fight everybody that's beautiful? Because the motherfucker told you you look ugly and you look old? And he done fucked on this young motherfucker right here with the lovers. He's separated from your ass for a reason. He was out. He was brought in. And now you mad. They say, huh? Excuse me, Rick. I'm going to go up into some shit. They say the, the Queen of Pentacles. This Queen of Wands. It could be Queen of Wands, Queen of Pentacles. Or is this a Queen of uh, Queen of Wands? could be dominantly Queen of Wands. We're not seeing too much Queen of Pentacles when it comes to this person. But they say... Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Wands, whoever she is or whoever you are, they say she caught this nigga cheating one time. And they say this motherfucker, it got so bad with her. She wanted to see how the other woman shit it when she sat on the toilet. She wanted to see how this other woman went to sleep at night. They say she got real close up on her ass. They say she got real close up. They say she wanted to see what it sound like when she was in a the shower. They wanted to see how she coexisted and talked with people around her. They say it got just that bad. Six of Cups energy. It got just that bad. She wanted to connect with the other woman. She wanted to exchange with the other woman to manipulate this masculine's direction taken when it comes to this other woman. Ain't that terrible? Clarify this. That's kind of nasty. The moon card, they said it got so nasty you could smell it. Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio. They say it depressed, it sent her into a state of depression. The moon, so bad. It was so hard for her to maneuver, seeing people face to face. So she wanted to get up on this other woman. To see what it looked like when she wiped her ass. Judgment. Eight of Pentacles. King of Wands. To see why this man desired her so much. She couldn't stand it. Let's clarify it. Eight of Wands energy and the Ace of Wands. This is a complete yes. Let's go into the moon further. What type of illusions or... She got so close up on this woman. It don't make no sense. The world card. The two of Wands. She wanted this man to walk away from this woman by any means. So you know what that tell me, Virgo? She ain't value herself enough to say, you know what? This is a clown. Seven of Wands, this is a clown. They say she stopped his ass at the door when it came to this woman. The Emperor? Is it a Sagittarius or an Aries that constantly deceives this woman or someone deceives you, Virgo? Or What is this, Virgo? I know you like a good chat. Every now and again, let's chat. <laughs> Nine of Cups. Whatever is behind this door, they say you could smell it. They say somebody a freak for smelling shit, too. I'm picking up on that strongly. Fuck is that about in the collective? What is the Nine of Cups? Four of Cups. They like to smell, sit up and smell shit and... Three of wands, they pick it up, smell it, sit back, get off. Damn. <laughs> what the fuck? 
Keep going on. Proof. Here's proof. That's a good laugh, Virgo. I know nobody ain't picking up your panties and smelling them. They might be. That might be some freak ass shit that go on. I don't know. The devil is a Capricorn somewhere. You see, they like the smell shit. Like. <laughs> Somebody freak for smelling. Mm, 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 mm. Eight of Swords, that's crazy. That's some crazy shit. Seven of Pentacles. Could you imagine catching somebody smelling some shit? Have you, Virgo? I don't know your experience. Have you? Or somebody. Somebody be on cloud nine. That's what I can say. Eight of Wands energy. So, Virgo, what I pick up on is, could be a Scorpio. Hold on. You say, slow down. Slow down. See, what they might do is when they be smelling shit, they might, you know, they might be listening as far as their surroundings go. Like, ooh, here they come. Let me put their down. Or, ooh, I just smelt this bitch seat. Or, I just smelt this nigga seat. Some shit like that. Like, damn. You got the, uh, a star, this an Aquarius. Aquarius, you doing this? King of Pentacles, Aquarius. Capricorn energy. This a uh, influ a very influential person that's a Capricorn. Something like that. They could have Capricorn highly aspected. They like that type of shit. That's terrible. That is terrible. That's the truth, too. Possessions. So someone likes to get someone else's possessions and shit and smell it. Face the swords. Cross the airways and shit. For many of y'all, let me stop tripping out. Let me stop playing for God. But there's some real shit. Um, for many of y'all, it's communication coming in. It's your person. It's somebody you fuck with emperor energy. He fits to say something to you. Or I even feel like um, a good laugh or success, Virgo, when it comes to you. Something that you're doing. For many of you, you cast a spell. So you casting a spell to a certain degree um do expect results or i feel like clarity when it comes to the spell that you cast okay uh someone's very very guarded to closing out a cycle so this is a relationship i feel like whoever this other woman is they don't want to close out the cycle with your person or whatever the case may be it's a leo the leo is crazier than a motherfucker they're so on point that they're wrong. Clarify it. We got to go up into this Queen of Wands Leo energy. Look, I know that's probably what you want. What's this? Because they be acting a damn fool. Death card and judgment. So Scorpio under judgment. They don't want no judgment as far as their transformation goes. So the uh, Leo could be losing their fucking mind. But they would like to judge other people and, you know, come out into the wilderness and fight. And, you know, scrap it up. But when it's time for the Queen of Swords to, you know, jive that motherfucking knife in the motherfucker. Put their ass down. Let them know what's going on as Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Swords. I feel that's what you've done when it comes to a Leo, right, Virgo? You let their ass know. Did you poach their ass? Are you a poacher? Someone going out into Africa as well? Slow down. Going out into Africa talking all this shit about what they doing in Africa, this, that, and the third name doing shit. And causing death and destruction. You ready? Where they at? Where the Scorpio Capricorn energy at? Where is the Leo energy? Come through. King of Pentacles, Queen of Swords. I ain't got to make shit up. Queen of Swords. You poaching the Leo? You had to slay their ass? Are you slaying the lion? What's next? They so high and mighty. See the Queen of Swords bring them to their motherfucking knees every time. What's the... uh? King of Swords, and you got the Knight of uh, Swords. So higher intelligence and gossip, Virgo, when it comes to that piece right there. Or I feel like something about a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Do expect some form of communication or compulsive energy when it comes to that person. I also get revelation when it comes to Aquarius. Exchanging. Some type of exchange when it comes to an Aquarius. You could have revelation about. Or this is a form of healing. I feel like no, there is no healing with that situation. Ten of Swords. What, what, where the healing? The healing done is conflict. It's constant shit. It's a constant battle. Where the fuck the healing go? Look at that feather. Feathers? What's going on with the healing? Or cat here? Dog here? I don't got no fucking cat. Somebody, what's going on? Somebody done fucked up a Leo. That's what I'm picking up on. They say cat here every motherfucking where. 
What's the two of cups and the fool? So somebody a damn clown. They be programmed, they programmed, they put into a specific place to, you know, be toxic. Cause restrictions and shit. That's what I'm picking up on, Virgo. A lot of shit going on in Africa. We not having it. We not having that with the motherland. You gonna go to the birthplace to do what? To do what? Try to cause endings for other people? For minority? Keep hearing minority. Something about the minority. Is it the indigenous people? Six of Wands energy. All that shit coming to an end as well. Because motherfuckers is up on their game. With the seven of pentacles. Discernment. Discern, discern, discern. Fuck all that bullshit. This shit right here. This is what they want for you. The minority or the indigenous people? Five of cups. Fuck that bullshit. We not having that. Let's grab an oracle. To close this out Virgo. Whoever the uh, the clown is, they put in specific arenas to truth be told there. Truth be told again. Whoever that uh, clown is, they're put in certain arenas for specific. It's like they they acquire lots of money to manipulate the people further, or they don't really bring in any real like type of healing or awareness amongst the people. Instead, they. You know, they sit up with these people as like friends and, you know, shit like that for financial gain. But I'm going to say this. These white people, truth be told again, these white people or whoever they associate and sit up with and think that they're chummy, chummy and close with, they don't give a fuck about them and they view them to be clowns and fools. OK, so what I pick up on with that, Virgo, is the African-American person, the, the Uncle Tom. The Uncle Tom, truth be told, the Uncle Tom of the situation or, you know, the motherfucker that had put on a black face and be that clown, you know. What one nigga won't do, another will. You see this? Truth be told. Let's open up the book, Virgo, and let's read. I think it's time to read, Virgo. It's time for us to read. Queen of Swords, Queen of Pentacles. This business? Read. What are you demanding? What are your demands as a person? Or this person or whoever the fuck you dealing with. What are they demand? They demanded some shit from you. I feel like you need to tell their ass the truth. Virgo, this is what I'm getting. Exchange with their ass. Can't make it up. Exchange with them. It might be unexpected even. Let their ass know what time it is. Virgo, this is what I'm getting. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Check my description box, Virgo, where y'all can book a personal reading. And um, Virgo, I'll get with you later. I hope this serves you well. Take care.